what's up? JD here, your fitness coach. Anyway, you know, busy dad, husband, you know, the whole bit. Got up this morning, had a killer day so far. Got up, and been training for the uh, Las Vegas Marathon for like the last two months. Anyway, just crushed my time on the 13-mile ride today by, let's see, two months ago, I did it in 15 minutes and like 54 seconds. Now I'm down to 59 minutes and 59 seconds. That's in two months. Anyway, awesome, man. Awesome thing. Got on the scale this morning. As soon as I got done with that, I am below 180 pounds now. I'm six foot, almost six foot one. I'm down to 180 pounds. I know you think, man, that's skinny, but I'll tell you what, I'm getting ripped up. It's ridiculous how good my cardio is getting, and I'm not gloating. I'm just saying I'm really proud of, you know, how much work I've put in this year, you know, and how much training I've done and how much I've trained other people. And, you know, I really get a kick out of helping people lose weight. I love it. You know, I'm not about getting big. You know, that's not my thing. You know, all my fireman buddies, my brother, everybody I hang out with, you know, all the guys I train with all the time, you know, the young guys, they love getting big, getting strong. You know, it's all about the look. But, you know, when you get into your 30s, like, I'll be 36 here real soon. I'm 35, but when you get into your mid-30s, 40s, 50s, whatever, it's all about good cardio, being healthy, keeping the weight off. That way your back doesn't hurt, your knees don't hurt. You know, just being in all-around good shape. You know, I'm 35, and I'm in the best, I literally, I'm in the best shape. I'm in, probably, I've been in the best shape I've been in since I was 19. When I was about 25 or 26, my brother had me in the gym every day, pushing weights. You know, he's a firefighter here in Las Vegas. He had me in the gym every day pushing weights. You know, and I was getting big, strong, but my cardio sucked. I mean, I couldn't run a mile. You know, I wasn't, my, my motocross wasn't doing that good. You know, but when I'll tell you what, when I started training and doing cardio every day and really learning and doing all the different things with nutrition and reading and, you know, and, uh, and learning about, you know, fat loss, that's when my cardio went out of control. That's when I became a really good motocross rider, when I could really put in 20 hard laps, you know, as fast as I can go. Anyway, I'm rolling down the freeway, just got done, dropped my daughter off from school. I'm sure you guys, everybody out there knows how it is. You're busy, guys, girls, whatever. You got to take the kids to school. You got to pack them lunches. But I'll tell you what, before I did that, I got up, I ran, or I rode 13 miles. Awesome, awesome. Now I'm going to the aquatic center. I'll tell you what, I'm going to go do a half mile to probably a mile. What you guys got to do, you really got to find out if there's a, you know, uh, aquatic center or a city pool or a public pool that's a lap pool, an Olympic-sized pool. Doing laps in an Olympic-sized pool is awesome. It is an amazing workout. 16 laps back and forth is a half mile. 32 laps back and forth is one mile. I'll tell you what, you want to get in shape, go swimming. You know, and you're, if you got a swimming pool in the backyard, you're lucky. If somebody in your family's got a swimming pool, you're lucky, you know. Measure it out. Figure out how many laps you're doing compared to an Olympic pool. That way you'll know, hey, exactly how far you're swimming. If you're swimming a quarter mile a day, whatever. Anyway, that's, uh, you know, JD's tip for the day. Go swimming. Swimming is great for your shoulders, your chest, your legs, your stomach, your back. It's an all-body workout. Plus, if you're married and you got kids, on Saturday, Sunday, whatever, you go to the pool, you take your kids with you. You know, so you can hang out with the family and you can get a really good workout if you push it. So that's it. This is JD, your fitness coach. I will talk to you guys later.